Uh, hey guys, I'm Brian Paul, sitting here in VR as always. This time we're playing a game called I'm Hungry. Uh, it came out in Europe, in the UK, I believe. Uh, not here in North America yet, although on the North American PlayStation blog they did say that it was coming out today, which meant yesterday, which meant uh, somehow it got delayed. Um, but, you know, it'll be here eventually. Um, th I want to say 13.99 quid? It's, check the description. I think I got that right. What's up, Abe Lincoln? What is going on, dude? So uh, so I tested this out just a little bit to make sure I had some semblance of an idea of what was going on. Uh, and I gotta tell you guys, uh, graphically this is blurry, but the art design is incredible. What's up? What's up, Preacher Plays? Uh, this is uh, from the, I think it's up the UK store. Uh, like I said in the description, it's like 14 quid. Uh, so let's do our career. I did only I did only the first two here. Uh, let's just go back real quick. You can do the small town or the winking park. Of course, this is another winking game. Uh, I've got to say, guys, um, winkings, winkings got their uh, says something about them, and they they're pushing out some VR games. Uh, some of them are good. Some of them are okay. <laughs> uh, so let's see. So this is let's just check out uh, the first stage that I already did. Uh, this is more of a tutorial stage as I strap my move controllers onto my wrists. And uh, we're going to take a quick look here. Here we go. Hey, good morning. Um, it's really late at night for me, but a good morning to uh, those of you who it's morning time. Getting up, drinking some exclamation point coffee, uh, making some eggs and bacon. That kind of thing. Uh, Preacher, this is a little Dead Hungry-like. Uh, definitely more of a cartoon aesthetic here. Uh, the, the the town out there is, is really good, but it is super blurry. You know how there's like trails uh, on like some of the blurrier games like Art Park? There's definitely some trails out there, but the art design is incredible, and you're not really looking out there anyway, but it is nice in the background. Uh, so let's... I'm up super late, Paige. All right. So here we go, this is, this is a tutorial mode, and he wants, okay, a soda. So it's unlocking things here for me so, it, so I can understand where I get these things from. The soda is weird. You put the cup there, you push the button, and you have to wait for all these things to happen here. So let's do this over here while we're, oh. It's not letting us do anything else because we're kind of in a tutorial mode. Oh well, what are you gonna do? Tutorial mode it is. Uh, so let's pick up the cup, we throw it onto the tray, we're good to go, uh, and then we go over here, this is our little frosty machine, pick up the cup, throw it here, you pull down the handle, and I think there's only one variety, you, you can only have the, uh, the mix of the chocolate and vanilla, which looks delicious, honestly. I'm hungry. I'm hungry, okay. Uh, so over here, this is our burger making machine, he wants a, hmm. alright, so, it's telling me to lift that up there, but it doesn't look like a normal burger, it looks like... Oh, crap. I totally just screwed that up. <laughs> Alright, so let's try this again. Here we go, let's see if that works. Hey, 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 what did you just, where'd that come from? <sighs> garbage, man. Total garbage. Look at this. So the burger that I didn't complete, I gotta throw, throw it all away. Because it's all grouped in together as a meal. Alright, well, it's a good thing this is a tutorial stage, huh? Alright, you know what? It's hot in my apartment. I didn't realize that I was sweaty until I started streaming. So let's do a quick sweat removal and get back to it here. Alright. <sighs> Sorry. Let's try that again. There we go, there we go. And this this burger doesn't look right. Like You see, there's actually some uh, d descriptive stuff. In, see, and it's hard, so hard to get rid of. Trash. All right. See, like, look at the burger, man. There's no bottom bun to that burger. Check this out. So this is looks like what he wants. All right, you guys. This is interesting because this is a tutorial, and uh, it's like the second time I've done the tutorial. Didn't have any problems the first time. They're making me put. They're making me put the other bun on. 
What just, what just happened? Did you see that? It took the lettuce out of the burger! What is going on right now? Oh, guys, I didn't realize how buggy this was until just now. It was going okay until... Well, until it wasn't. Let's see how this goes. No, it's not the same devs who made Dead Hungry. Ah, he seems to be happy. Alright, let's take his money. Uh, this will be a lot more fun when it stops being so buggy. All right, what's up, dude? What, what can I what can I get for you today? Looks like you want some fries, so it unlocks the fry machine over here. Pretty cool looking stuff here. You take the fry basket out, you you, you, you scrunch some fries. Good. Uh, most of the most of the grip detection is actually fine, uh, but man, I. I played for a little bit before I started streaming and didn't encounter any problems, and then, holy crap, we ran into problems. Uh, okay, I guess burgers, normal burgers it is. Um, so we get the bun, we get the lettuce, stay lettuce, stay, good lettuce. Who's, who's a good lettuce? Alright, and he wants cheese out of a bottle, that's a thing, uh, and then we need... What is going on? How do I pick up the entire burger? I am so confused right now. Yo, something is totally glitched. I was, it was, everything was working just fine. And now it's not. Alright. You know what's really fun about this? Is that there's, as far as I can tell, there's no way to quit. You can push the, uh, the square button to like point at things. Can I point anything back here to let me quit? Maybe you just have to start the level over. Maybe it just glitched. Oh, 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 what'd you... What can I click on to get out of here? What's up, Danish Gaming? Uh, it's almost four o'clock in the morning. Okay. Uh, so I guess... I, mean, I don't know what to do. Yeah, no, I'm, I, I'm with you guys, man. This, this is not looking good for the game. <laughs> man, I was, you know, just before I started streaming, I was like, this is going to be a lot of fun. This is actually pretty cool. And then, like, holy shit, man, did we just run into trouble. Uh, we ran into big trouble, and I can't, there's no way to quit the level? Like, how garbage is that? Come on. I'm, like, looking around, because this is nothing. There's nothing. Okay, luckily it's only 23 seconds left. So how are you guys doing today? I'm just going to stop playing for 23 seconds. Uh, because cause all I'm going to do is frustrate myself. <laughs> Thank, thanks for staying up and hanging out with me. Yeah, Winking is definitely one of those uh, lower tier developers uh, who doesn't doesn't always nail it. Uh, luckily, you know, they're trying. They're, I guess they're. I guess all I can say is that they're trying uh, to, to create some cool games. I, I don't. I don't know if they're succeeding. All right. So let's let's go to next. Hey, hey what's up, Mr. Caprioni? Meow. Mr. Caprioni, you didn't miss a thing, man. You missed nothing. What's up, Daniel? No one, no one missed anything, man. No one missed anything because, uh, because we just had a, a horrible first run on our tutorial level. Uh, so we, I think we're just gonna skip the tutorial level and go right to the next one. Winking uh, was the uh, so the, they're the developers behind Unearthing Mars, uh, and very little else. They published, uh, they published the most recent Mars Alive. They published. Oh god, 18 floors? Um, but they haven't really actually developed much. And then you have to do this. Look at this. You have, you have to stare at that thing just to keep going. Alright, you know what? Here we go. Here we go. Two, level 2. Let's try this again. What does it say? Speed package skill. 1, 2... Oh, okay. So when you pick up the bag, there's a there's a skill so that where instead of shaking it to open it, you 
swoop and I think pick everything up. I think that's what this is trying to tell me here. I think, I think, I don't, I don't know. What do these, what do you think these arrows could be on the corners? This is very confusing. Okay, uh, let's play. Let's play. It's a nice little clip art animation of a cash register. Not animating actually, just static. But what are you gonna do? Oh, 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 it animated. <laughs> All is well. All is well. Did you just call me Brain? Okay, uh, so here we go. Some blurry backgrounds, but awesome art design. Oh man. Uh, yeah, no, the, the graphics are fine. You know, you get used to a little bit of blur. It's it's a little bit blurrier than it should be here in the foreground, but man, the art design is pretty incredible, so I'm willing to forgive it. Um, hi. Wait, wait, seriously? Do you know your twin's behind you? All right, we need some fries. Here, pick this up. We'll do that. Let's let's see if we run into any more problems. Let's see if that was just like a one-time thing, like a horrible first impression thing. All right, you want a little bit of this, a little bit of this, a little bit of this. So this is this is hot hot pepper sauce, and that's cheese sauce. It's not what you'd think it would be, you know, like ketchup and mustard, but whatever. Oh, I picked up the whole thing. Man, that was a monumental moment right there. All right, let's see if this works. Ah, it didn't work. Ah. Yeah, he, he just pointed at me. He's like, yeah, dude. He's like, you just made my food. I'm so excited. All right, here we go. Thank you so much for the money. Goodbye. Hey, it's your twin. Yo, I haven't played him to a VR game in a very long time. I guess Ghost Giant, maybe? I don't know, man, because I don't really have time. Once I, re once I play a game long enough to review it, uh, I have to move on and play something else. So platinum trophies aren't something I really hunt for like I used to. Uh, once upon a time before without parole, I used to hunt trophies a lot. I used to play some really dumb games for trophies. Uh, so I don't know, man. I don't, did I even platinum Ghost Giant? I don't remember. I don't think I did. I'd have to go back and maybe finish that. Uh, finish the platinum. There's a few cool little things you have to do to get the platinum in that. Hello, you look interesting. What can I get for you? All right. <laughs> that guy did actually click his heels. Uh, no, Counterfight 3. Counterfight 3 is the worst of the series. Um, the problem with uh, Counterfight 3. The problem with Counterfight 3 is that the, uh, the tracking is actually pretty bad. Um, there's some stuff going on with it. Uh, it's like not totally accurate. There's some issues uh, There's like lobsters that hang over here in counterfight 3 and you have to grab them But like you can't it's really difficult if you want more information uh, We talked quite a bit about counterfight 3 on the last week's episode of PSVR Gamescast live uh, So you're more than welcome to check that out uh, There are no timestamps so good luck finding it, but you can usually scroll through and find By the trailer because we always show the trailer uh, so hopefully that's helpful. Uh, what are we doing here? Uh, the, the other bun. Here, we'll throw that onto the tray. We need these here. We'll throw those here. Waiting for some fries to come out. Here we go. Fries are here. Done. And scoop them up. See, this is actually kind of fun. We had we had horrible first impressions, but it turned out to be quite all right. Thank you for the cash, sir. There's like a thousand dollar bill right there. No change for the big dude. Hey, dude. Nice glasses. What can I get for you? I'm Brian, I'll be taking care of you. Dude, m make a decision, dude. Uh, uh, Dave Page, uh, I will say, uh, I will say it's, it's, I'm I'm am gonna I'm gonna buy a PS5 at launch no matter what I don't care how much it costs man like that's not an issue um, I will I will spend whatever it takes to keep this channel going Ooh do you see that Do you see that That was that was craziness I probably could throw a burger at a customer here look can I just throw a bun Let's see Oh oh no 
I think if you accidentally waste food, you lose you lose seconds. And we can't lose seconds. They're precious. All right, what can I get for you? Hey, how many meals are you gonna have today, sir? You know, we have to we have to look out for your health. You can't just eat fast food all the time. <laughs> do 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 do. Here's the top bun. All right, here we go. Here, do that over here. Throw that over here. Give me, hurry up, hurry up. We have 11 seconds left. Come on, we can do this. 11 seconds. Ah, got it. Okay, here you go, sir. And give me some money. Two seconds, two seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Give me, this. Give me money. Give me money. Ah, there we go. All right. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, was, that, was that Kyle who just asked about that? Um, yeah, it's... It's a blurry game, man. It's a, it's it's actually very blurry, but it's okay. I actually don't have any complaints about the blurriness uh, because the art design is so good. So, I can't say that uh, terribly often, to be honest with you. Oops. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's check my volume in the headset here. Uh, so that went okay. Um, you know, there's there's definitely much less blurry games out there uh, that do a very similar thing. Um, you know, obviously, I, I actually really enjoyed the first two Counterfight games, Counterfight and Counterfight Samurai Edition, uh, and Diner Duo is pretty awesome, too. <sighs> They're all okay, you know? I think Counterfight 3 needs to be fixed before I can recommend it, uh, but this is this is good, too, uh, as long as you don't run into the bug that I ran into. And why after every level? Why? Why do they make me stare at this... somewhere? Right there? All right, I have to stare right there. Why do I have to do this? Dead Hungry. There's another one. Yeah, this is like Dead Hungry, uh, except, you know, less violent and less throwing of food. Uh, you know. So, so far, so good. Hold the button. Release the button. All right. Uh, Dave Page, I think Sony learned their lesson. Um, I think back when Sony released the PlayStation 3 and they like charged like what five or six hundred bucks for it, they learned a really hard lesson then. They knew that they they learned uh, and they showed with the PlayStation 4 that you really can't charge more than four hundred dollars for a console. Um, so I think I think we're gonna see four hundred dollars again. I'm I'm pretty sure of that. Um, if not, I mean, what are you gonna do? Uh, hey, P Peter, I have not wanted to curse out any customers yet. I, I have I have wanted to curse out the controls uh, when it wasn't working. Yeah, uh, what's going on, Kyle? Uh, yeah, I like it so far. I really do like it so far. Um, I, I could probably do some of these ahead of time here. Oops. What's going on, Jack Jackson? You know, what's going on, everybody? Everybody's uh, up late at night, hanging out, watching me play this crazy new game. <laughs> there you go, sir. Yeah, yeah, now give me some money. Hello, sir. Well, a lot of people out on the street, man. All right, so let's see. We can make one of these here. We can make one of these here. Yes, yes, good. Okay, and then we're going to make a burger while those are being made. Uh, and that one has the cheese bottle. Cheese, not mustard, cheese. Yep, that's right. Here we go. We'll throw that on there. We'll throw that on there. We'll throw this on here. Oh, guys, is isn't... Hold on a second. I didn't realize the music was so low. Here, let me turn up the uh, turn up the music a little bit here. There we go. How, how does that music level sound, guys? Uh, Jock Jackson, I don't know, like. You, you gotta take a look at this game and go, is this something I really want to play? We've had a lot of these style of games, uh, so, you know, it's uh, it's totally your call. There we go. There we 
go. Enjoy that. And a lot of people from all over the place. Thank you guys for hanging out. Alright. What, what can I do for you, young lady? Oh, look at that. She wants stuff. Alright. Do, 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 do. She wants burger. Burger! Hey, of course, Mr. Caprioni, you're very, very welcome for the stream. Uh, I was, uh, I just finished writing my Project Lux, uh, there we go, Project Lux review, and I was, I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but I hate doing voiceovers at night because my voice is always hoarse at night, uh, so I like to do voiceovers first thing in the morning, so I'm going to record my Project Lux voiceovers in the morning, and I was like, what can I do between now and then? Hey, sir. Okay. That's right, listen to Kyle, man. Kyle knows what he's talking about. Definitely join our Discord server. Uh, I've <laughs> I played Slumball for like five minutes. That was, uh, this is bad, man. Slumball was bad. Here you go, man. Are you happy? Are you happy and you know it? Can you clap your hands? Oh wait, he's mad about something. What'd I forget? Oh no, dude, here, I, oh, sorry. I, I totally, totally forgot to put that in the meal. Oh, I'm so sorry, Blondie. All right, what can I do for you, uh, Mr. Lumberjack Ginger Dude? All right, let's do this. <laughs> There's a lot of repeat customers, best chef in town. Oh, what else can I do for this guy? I don't think anything burns. That's the lucky part of this. Is that like you can get things started and then just kind of grab them when you're ready. There we go. Oop, 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 oop. Hey, hey, sir. Uh, there you go. There's your cloud of smoke. Enjoy. <laughs> how's, the, how's the music uh, level sounding, guys? Did, did that go up con enough for the stream? Thank you very much. Alright. Oh, oh, oh. Just... Just ran out of time. Perfect. This is a lot of fun. I, I can't complain, Jock Jackson. Uh, this is this, this is a good time. So Kyle, this uh, this game is out in the UK and Europe. So this game's out in Europe right now. Um, here, I'm trying to find. Uh... Sorry for the delay, guys. I'm trying to figure something out here real quick. Here we go. Um, it's out in Europe, and if you check the description, you'll see that uh, I bought it for, I think it was 14 pounds. Uh, from the UK store, uh, so I, I saw on the US PlayStation blog that it was supposed to launch here yesterday. Uh, so if I think today's the third, it's supposed to launch on the second. There's obviously an issue with that. It didn't quite happen the way it was supposed to. Um, so I'm guessing this will be, you know, around the $15 mark. We'll see. Uh, whoever's asking about tracking. Uh, with tra tracking for me is... Uh, I, I don't technically, or I don't traditionally, I guess, have tracking issues. Um, the camera is about, let's see, I'm about 6'1", and I think the camera is like just an inch or two higher up off the ground than I am. So maybe around 6'2", 6'3", right? Right about here. And I'm standing about, I want to say, seven feet, seven feet from the wall it's up against. Uh, and generally, I have pretty good luck. I, I, I almost never need to change it outside of Bartender Simulator, which was a complete and total disaster. Um, but everything else has been pretty good, so uh, so no real complaints. Uh, hopefully you can you know adjust your setup so it works better for you. Uh, you do have to aim the camera down slightly so it can kind of see your whole play area. Um, but yeah, I mean experiment, experiment because you're gonna find something that works for you. Uh, I also am really, really lucky. I have this I have this gigantic window behind me, and for some reason I never have issues with reflections or anything else that everyone else has problems with, so I'm just going to count my blessings and be happy that I, uh, that everything works the way it's supposed to. 
All right, so it does take a second here for even your first customer to walk up. You have a five minute time limit and like nothing's happened for the first 20 seconds. And that guy's gonna cross the street. Oh, hey, he crossed the street. Excellent. Okay, so I should I should have been smarter and like actually started this before, but whatever, it's all good. Here we go, we'll get one of these started here. There we go. And, oop, burger, 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 burger. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. I totally, uh, I totally lost. I totally lost my uh, my headset for a while there, guys. Didn't couldn't hear any of the comments, and I couldn't I couldn't talk to you. Um, every time I with this new setup, man, something always goes horribly wrong. Uh, let's see if we can still pass this stage. I don't know what we're doing here. We're just gonna make a little bit of everything, honestly. You know what? Why aren't why aren't we making French fries at the same time, just for the heck of it? You know, I don't know why we're not doing that. Just why not? What can I get for you? Okay, we get burger, 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 spicy burger, burger, ah, burger. Oh, it wasn't ready to be opened yet. These actually do have to prepare. Uh. Oh no! Oh no! Please tell me you want a spicy burger. I got one on my wrist right here. Uh. Okay, we'll put that back. Oh no! Crap. Okay. Uh, lesson learned. Don't pick up anything unless you're sure the customer is ready for it. Uh, Vacation Simulator is definitely better than this, uh, Jock Jackson. I think Vacation Simulator is surprisingly good for somebody who always thought Job Simulator was a little bit overrated. That was always fun, but not like crazy good. Um, but yeah, Job Simulator. Man, the longer you play that, the more it kind of gets the tooks into you. Oh, I don't know if she was... <laughs> I don't think she was looking over the counter, but I could be wrong. Okay, we already made one of those. We'll make one of these real quick, and you also want burger, right? With something hot. There we go. Ready to go. Bam, 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 and... There you go, sir. What? He's upset about something. What do you think he's upset about? Oh, no, he wanted two sodas? Man, he... He is really mad. Hmm. I have never worked fast food. My brother worked fast food for... a couple weeks, and then he quit. I think he worked at McDonald's. All right, let's see if we can't get this one right. This, this one, I'm not sure what threw me for a loop the last time, but I just wasn't paying attention, I guess. I was trying to get caught up. It didn't go very well. Now we'll get caught up. And it'll go just fine. Alright, we need... Uh, I don't think Jockey rolls things to me. Vacation Simulator is definitely better than this. Uh, Vacation Simulator is awesome. This is, this is okay. Like, this is doing exactly what you want it to do. Um, I'm just not incredibly sure... not incredibly sure uh, like where this is going like I don't know how much difficult how how much more difficult this is gonna get I don't know if these levels are gonna get hard to pass uh, I'm assuming they are I, I Uh, so I didn't, I guess I didn't get any stars, so I guess I didn't even pass the level, which makes sense, because I totally screwed up an order, and uh, I had to sit down and fix my headphones for part of it, 
So maybe that's, uh, maybe this is, it's getting a little more challenging, or maybe I just should stop screwing around and do my job properly. Maybe, maybe not. We'll find out. Yeah, the, the issue is, is like, and I really hate this right here. You have to like look at a pinpoint area to make that line disappear. Why, why, why does it think I just bought my PlayStation VR yesterday? Okay, I guess we're doing that level again. All right. We have to we have to do better than four customers. Like four happy customers is our goal. I, th I think we can probably handle that. My my issue my question, hey, laser may mayonnaise, that's I'm still not sure if that's how you pronounce uh, your screen name. But um, my issue with this one is that I think this is all there is to it. Like the drink, fries, burger, and frosty machine, and bagging them up. Is that all there really is? Like, if that's all there really is, there's not a whole lot to this at all. So I'm very, very curious to see, like, how the difficulty ramps. Um, good cooking game that's not job or vacation simulator. Uh, I would try Diner Duo. Diner Duo is, is pretty solid, man. It gets really difficult really fast. It's good two-player. Uh, you can get somebody in on the, uh, on the social screen playing with you. This guy's making taking a hard, long time to decide. What, what do you think? Oh wow, he wants a little bit of everything. Okay, here we'll get one of these for him. All right, so let's see. You want one? Hey, hey, good morning, Ruth. What's going on, dude? Okay, so he wants two sodas. We can totally handle that. Let's do one of these over here. Uh, he wants a spicy burger. Seems like that's the only difference between the burgers. Is do you want it spicy or do you want it with cheese? I don't, I don't know, man. That doesn't sound horribly complicated. But let's see if we made his meal right. There you go, sir. All bags, ready to go. He's freaking out. He's really happy. Hook up the tip, dude. Come on, hook it up. Thank you, sir. It's like a thousand dollar bill in the till. No change required. That's right. You know. I don't know if you saw the guy who was just here, but I have a feeling you might know him. You know what, there, there is, Kyle's right, there is absolutely an upgrade. There's absolutely an upgrade system. So I'm gonna check that out in a second. Uh, yeah, if you weren't following the Vacation Simulator conversation earlier, uh, yeah, uh, Vacation Simulator is totally worth it. But, I mean, you really have to like the job simulator, like, genre, if that's a thing. Is it a genre? I don't know. Is it? Could it be? Who knows? I get to pick things up and throw them genre, and, uh, and, and I enjoy it. I think it's better than job simulator, big time. He seems... Is he happy? He didn't seem super happy. Hey, dude, what's going on? You, know, you, you can just bring your twin up here and you can order together, uh, or, or whatever. You know, I don't care. Just do, just do things however you want to. Yeah, Diner Duo is local multiplayer only. Yes, it is. Oh, nice. I'm glad you like the new stream layout, Taylor. Um, it definitely looks better than just hitting the stream button, for sure. I'd like to get the Without Parole logo uh, up on the screen, though, and... Uh, maybe make the chat window take up a little less space but you know we're still working on it we're trying to between me and AJ we're trying to come up with a format that looks good for both of our streams um, something that we're both happy with we'll see how that goes thank you sir there we go oh, hey how's it going let me, let me start making some fries for you bud I have, you look like a fry guy oh you're not a fry guy okay well let's do something else for you then whoa okay here we go do these uh, those last two guys are blonde breath, um, but you know, there's a lot of duplicate characters. Uh, Rune Christensen, uh, what are you just debating between? Vacation Simulator and something else, or are you just debating? Oh no, put that down. There you go. Okay, Get some money. I'm not going to give you any change, so move along. Hey, little girl, what do you want? Do you want some french fries? I hope you do, because I just made some. 
Yeah, you do. How lucky is that? Okay, we also want some some sugar, frozen sugar. Here we go. Have some frozen sugar. Have some frozen sugar. Here we go. There we go. Uh, Jack Jackson, I'm glad I can be uh, at the service. Oh, oh, she's got like change. And you're definitely not getting change for your change. That's like a million gold coins. I'm not sure what just happened there. Alright. Um, I'm always happy to help, you know? If you guys have any questions about what games you should buy, uh, that's kind of what I'm here for. That's kind of why I play all the games, so that I can actually answer your questions. There we go. Cheese sauce? I love cheese sauce, man. Uh, what, what do they call it in Vacation Simulator? Beach cheese? Yeah, I definitely want a beach cheese machine in my kitchen. There we go. <laughs> Between Job Simulator and Vacation Simulator, Vacation Simulator is way better, it's just more fun. Yeah, everyone should join the Discord server. Whoever just uh, brought that up, thank you so much. Uh, the link is in the description for the Discord. Uh, it's always a good time. Uh, it doesn't matter what time you stop in, man. I stop in at 5 o'clock in the morning. I stop in at midnight. I stop in at, in the afternoon. There's always a conversation going on. Uh, so the music, I can't I can't actually hear the music. Uh, so you tell me if the music is too loud. Um, I, turned, I turned it way down so I could focus on the game. Speed package skill. I, I think I'm doing this right. Woohoo! Alright, let's try level 5. Let's play level 5. We're doing this. We're playing level 5. I have a, I have a uh, suspicious feeling that it's going to look a lot like level 1, 2, 3, and 4. Um, I, I think the environment doesn't change at all until we beat these levels and then go to Winking Park, if that's what it was called, the, the amusement park. And then again, I'm sure it's just different food like cotton candy and hot dogs and that kind of stuff. But we'll find out. Job Simulator Laser Mayonnaise was definitely a PSVR launch title. That's what I can tell you on that. Uh, I don't know if I can tell you any more. making food. What can I get for you, sir? Come on. Come on. Come on. What do you want? Dude. There we go. He definitely wants some stuff. Uh, here, but let's get another batch of fries going real quick, because he wants two fries. Why didn't he just order a large fry? Why isn't there an option for a large fry? What kind of burger? A spicy burger. Oops. Yep. I just lost some time because I just threw away a burger bun. Spicy burger. There we go, threw it on the tray, and do that. Grun Christensen, I think uh, people ask me this question a lot, and the best VR game of all time is Resident Evil 7. Hands down, that game is unbelievable. I have so much fun with Resident Evil 7 every single time I drop into it. It still scares me, even though I know where all the scares are coming. It is incredible. I played it once on normal, twice on Madhouse. Uh, I'm about to. I've got my infinite ammo uh, perk already on that game. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, and I cannot wait to go back and speed run it so that I can get uh, unlock even more weapons. That's weird. My tracking seems to be losing every so often. Shoots here. Okay. I'll throw that up here. We need one of these. Oh, I could have sworn I started one of these. Uh, Laser Man Azer, what difficulty can I play on Beat Saber? I can, I'm, I'm pretty solid on hard level, uh, <laughs> but but expert, uh, there are only a couple songs I can finish on expert, like the ones I've done over and over and over and over. I just haven't had time like AJ, like AJ's devoted like 50 hours to Beat Saber. I've devoted all of like eight, maybe. Um, I really just wish I had time to play the games that I love. Uh, instead, I have to play games to review and do live streams like this. Uh, Lou, I think you're good to go on Firewall. <laughs> Firewall does seem to be up and running. They are still updating it um, with patches. I think there was just another patch today. and, uh, and every But everything seems to be up and running and going smoothly. So, uh, so definitely if you have an aim controller, you should absolutely be playing. 
Firewall. There's no question about that at all. Firewall's still one of my favorite games. Come on, come on, come on. Just, attack. Okay. Just one surprise, man. Here we go. Is there a cop? Oh no, there's a cop. Shut the place down. Shut the place down. We've got illegal game cats in the back. I there was a cop back there. Oh, I'm so, I'm so screwed. Oh, don't, don't. He, he can see me sweating. <clears throat> yeah, Junior, this is okay. Whoa. The Exorcist made you, give you motion sickness? Oh man, I feel so bad for you. So bad if you had motion sickness and exorcist, because the exorcist is definitely one of those games that like I, had, I struggled with, be not because of motion sickness, but because, well, I didn't know what was going to happen, and I thought, and it really scared the crap out of me. Wait, fries, drink, there we go. There you go, officer. Thank you for your service. Pay up. You don't get a meal in the house. That's right. And you're not getting changed. Get out of here. Uh, Jack Jackson, the great thing about Affected the Manor is that it's, a, I think, a trilogy, right? And uh, Perp Games picked up the, the publishing rights to, to publish the physical version of it when they when they get all of the different parts. So it's like affected the manner, affected the this, affected the that. And then once it's all done, it's gonna be a physical release. <sighs> Taylor Gaming, what was the first? Thank you, sir. What was the first? All right, that's it, six, six wins, no losses. That was it. Only two stars, we could have done better than that. Um, first game I played on PSVR. So that's a tough one, man. Um, because I, I bought a bunch of games, I pre-ordered the play. I pre-ordered PlayStation VR from Amazon. It showed up on launch day uh, with a bunch of games that I had pre-ordered. Um, and so I don't know if I put in the. I think I put in the demo disc first, and I tried Drive Club VR. I don't know if that was my first game, but it was one of the first couple that I tried, and I was like, holy crap! Like all of the negative reviews I had seen about it, about people feeling sick about the graphics not being good. I was like, holy crap, those people are ridiculous. And almost right away, that's when I knew I wanted to review PSVR games because I didn't agree with any of the reviews I'd seen on it. Uh, Rune Christensen, I am from uh, outside of Boston, Massachusetts, a town called Worcester, Massachusetts. Uh, and uh, and that's where everybody from Without Parole is from. I found Dez and Michelle working at the restaurant I work at. <laughs> I say work at, but I'm almost never there anymore. Uh, I've been there once in the last month, but Worcester's pretty awesome. <sighs> Captain Reth, I think Rush of Blood was definitely one of my one of my first ones too. Um, and man, Rush of Blood is still one of my top tens. Uh, Kyle, I'll check out the upgrade system in just a minute. Um, I am curious to see how these things upgrade. Obviously, they all move a little bit on the slow side, so. Being able to, uh, maybe that's the reason I couldn't get three stars in the last one, because I could have done everything a little bit faster. But I guess we'll, we'll find out here. We'll, we'll prep for we'll prep for dinner service here. I love the cartoon world, man. Like, it looks really nice, even though it's blurry. That, like, cartoon fire hydrant, you know, just everything, man. It's like, just a cool-looking world. Oops, I shouldn't have picked it up. I shouldn't have picked it up. What if the first customer doesn't want this? I'm going to lose time. I'm going to eat them. I'm going to eat them. Please, yes, oh, locked out big time. Oh, yep. B Batman Arkham VR. That was another early one for me, too. Oh, from Denmark, man. That's cool to hear. Thanks for watching. That goes for everybody. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I don't care where you're from. I do care where you're from because I think it's cool. But, uh, but, uh, but, yeah. But I love all you guys. You're awesome. Meow, meow. Ah, the cops here. Second and third best. God, I think I, I always say Skyrim is one of those games that, like, I know it got made already outside of VR, um, <clears throat> but 
I never cared about it that much until it came to VR. So that was a big deal for me. Uh, I think Borderlands, it should be in, your, in the top five, but I don't know if it's in my top five. Um, God, I don't know. It's a tough question. The, the Persistence is one I like to go back to quite a bit. He's very happy about this. He's very happy. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, James Clark, what's happening, dude? Yeah, Raw Data is a great game, man. Um, it would have been so much better if we got the multiplayer from the PC version, but what are you gonna do, man? It's like you, you kind of have to, kind of have to enjoy what you got. Uh, no, I, I didn't. I didn't get this key from Linking. I bought this off the, the UK store. Uh, I do try to. I do, I do try to tell you guys if uh, if if a game gets if I get if I get a game. What am I missing here? I'm missing. Oh, I need fries. Are you kidding me? How do I need fries? I got this bag in my hand. I can't even put the bag down until I get the fries. Ugh. Yeah, I'm always try. I'm always pretty try to be transparent about when I get a, a video game uh, for free. Uh, usually, it's in the description. Sometimes I forget to say it in the video itself. There we go. Here you go, old lady. Uh, but you know, I hope everyone understands that. Like, you know, some, somebody on Reddit was kind of poking at me today, saying that, "Oh my God, she's so slow." Hey, could you just, just give it to me? Do I have to take it from you? Okay. Uh, poking me on Reddit, saying that like, like almost like you can't trust my opinion because I got a game for free. And I was like, all right, well then, don't watch the channel, man, because because that's just how that's just how it works. Also, don't watch IGN, don't watch uh, Kind of Funny, don't watch anybody that reviews games because everybody gets them for free. Um, you just can't expect uh, like if I had to buy every single game, it would be. I mean, think about how much money that would cost. Um, so it'd just be like really unfair to reviewers to that. be like, hey, you have to spend a ton of money. All right, here we go. Uh, he's very happy about this meal. Nice dreads, dude. Nice dreads. Well, he, did he just take that money out of his dreads? Man, I wonder what else is hiding up there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, whoa, you're a new person. What's up, new person? What can I get for you? Oh, good, fries. That's perfect, because I'm already making fries. Okay. We also need a burger. A spicy, spicy burger. Tried to open it too early. You can't open them until they're blue. What are you doing? What are you trying to punch me over the counter? What is going on, dude? Just relax. Relax, biker guy. Here we go. Some fries for coming down the chute, and here they are. Alright, here you go. What? <laughs> Alright, he's, he's thrilled, man. He's thrilled. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Yes, rub that belly. Yep, come back. Eventually, for something. I don't know. Uh, what are we doing here? go in a bag off for you how are we doing we got 23 seconds left do you think we can actually make another order in 23 seconds that little girl uh here thank you there we go let's see let's see just in case she wants fries we'll get them all ready to go i don't know if we can do it in that many seconds so uh what do you want little girl how about one of these you want one of these i can make one of these how about one of these i can make one of these too what do you want ah oh, she wants that in there okay and one here Three seconds. Three seconds. Oh, come on. Why does this take so long? Why does this take so long? I know it's with the I don't Okay, fine. I tried. I tried. I tried to pre-make your order, little girl. No stars? I got no stars? None for all that. $123. 8.4 calories born. 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 And no stars. James Clark is dead hungry and he good. Dead Hungry's good. Uh, Dead Hungry's good in the same way this is good. You just have to kind of compare the two videos and see uh, and see what you like, man. Um, they're both good. Dead Hungry's good. This is good. But just uh, but just look and see what kind of gameplay it is. Dead Hungry's way harder than this. It's way more frantic. 
Um, I'm not sure which one I like better. I probably like Dead Hungry better just because it is more frantic and you're throwing food and I like zombies. Um, and uh, everything's a little more tangible. You can actually pick up things and like just throw them. The zombies will eat them. Uh, all right, so let's uh, let's go back and check out the uh, go back to the small town. Oh, wait a minute. Go back, back again. Machine upgrade. Boy, it's in the main menu. It's a little strange. All right, let's see what we can upgrade. Uh. Are these, they all say $10,000 to upgrade. Um, that's way more expensive than I would have expected. I have $506 and they all cost $10,000 to upgrade. Um, I guess we'll preview something here. Uh, let's preview this. Just pull it to preview it, I guess. Ooh. Uh, did we actually upgrade it or did we preview? P pull it again. No money. Okay, so we, we did preview it. Um, so let's preview all these things, man. Let's see what they... Ah, that's uh, not a whole lot different. Okay, let's preview this one over here. I mean, I mean, these all look, you know, dramatically different, but hopefully they, uh, hopefully they make food faster. Whoa! Looks like we can make two fries at once. <laughs> nice. All right. But that's it, man. Like ten thousand dollars to upgrade. Uh, this is. It's gonna take us a while to get there. Uh, but you know what? Be before we call this quits. How to, how, how do we get out of here? Oh, there it is. Back. Hey, Captain Rath, take it easy, dude. Um, I don't know how long this stream's going to go for. I, I didn't want to spend all day doing this. Uh, let's check out Challenge. Okay, so we need Challenge, infin Infinity, and Infinity Hell. So there's those. Uh, we can do go back to Career. Now let's see if we can go to Linking Park. All right, so there's 18 levels in Linking Park. And in small town, there's also 18 levels. So 36 levels for about 15 bucks, I'm guessing. I'm not sure how the conversion rate goes. But holy crap, man, like we didn't, we didn't, we got zero stars on stage six. And we're, we can't upgrade our machine. So does that mean we just need to play these stages over and over and grind? <laughs> Do we just need to grind until we have enough money to upgrade the machines? That seems like a pretty tall order. Pretty tall order. Uh, I don't know if that's something I really want to do. We only have like 500 bucks. We have to play these 20 more times <laughs> to have enough to upgrade one machine. And we we only, we get zero stars. It wasn't even one star. <sighs> All right, I'm going to give level six one more chance, and then we're calling it a day. Because I'm going to go to sleep eventually, I guess. Can't make burgers all night. I don't know why this place is 24 hours. Sunny outside though, so I don't know where we are. Yep. Got the cash machine overflowing with cash. That must not be our cash machine, because we we need ten thousand dollars in ours. Hanging out here. Look, we had to wait like 20 seconds for our first customer. Mm. I guess we should probably start getting some stuff ready here. <laughs> ah, that's a tall order pun. I like the like for that. I'll take that. Robert McAllister just asked if I can make a burrito. Did you see what ingredients I'm working with here, man? Did you see? Game cat. All right. Come on, come on, just hand it over. These people are so slow. Do you understand? I need to make $10,000 to upgrade my machines. 
What are you looking for, bud? What can I make for you today? Alright, here, let me just get these fries started. That's not what I meant to do. What do you want? What do you want? I want one of these, and one of these, and a cheesy burger. Okay, right here, and ah, there we go. Good to go. There we go. I know you're happy. Give me some money. Show me how happy you are. Good. Get out of here. I'm going to see your brother in just a minute. Hey, what up, dude? Look how, look how red his eyes are. Look how red his eyes are. His eyes are so red, he's so high! <laughs> there we go, thank you very much, get out of here. Move along, move along, we got money to make. We got money to make. Yes sir, what can I make for you? What can I make for you, sir? Oh, well, Jesus, hey, he wants every to everything! Alright, he wants a burger with cheese? Let's start with a burger with cheese. these. We need to make another one of those. Okay, good. Get one of these here, right? No! Yes, good. I almost screwed up. Holy crap. Uh, we need fries. Now we need a burger with the spicy stuff. <laughs> this is a big order, man. This is, this is an actual, no pun intended, big order. There we go. A lot of stuff on this tray. Let's see if we can't get it right. Alright, good, good. Uh, good. Do we get two of these? Not yet. Here we go. I think that's everything. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Boom. There we go. There you go, sir. I hope you're happy. Uh, if you're not happy, then just please file your complaint to the complaint department and, uh, and, and move along. Thank you very much. All right. Got all sorts of stuff going on here. We're ready to make burgers. What can I get for you? I got everything ready. I got everything ready. What do you want, dude? All right, here we go. Want one of these? Want one of these? Here we go, bam! Here we go. All right. Now let's see. Let's get everything ready here. Let's make. Keep making stuff. Let's keep everything going. Want to make sure we have everything ready. Thank you, sir. Keep on moving. Ready for the next customer. Oh God, the slow, the slow old lady. Uh, okay. Spicy and soda. There we go. Keep making food, keep making food. Here, hand it over, lady. Yeah, good. Okay, good. Uh, Rune just asked how much this game is. It's like 14 quid on uh, the UK store. Uh, but I don't know how much it's going to be when it's the US store. Oh, no, 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 I missed that time bonus. Time bonus! button, of course. That's all he wants. Nice and easy. Here you go. Get out of here. <laughs> Alright, let's make sure we keep the food being made. Good, good, good. Here, just do one of these. Thank you very much, sir. Do that right there. Good. Go. Move. I really, really want to get three stars. Uh, here, let's start a burger for this guy. Good. And he wants a spicy one. Good. Oh, come on. There we go. Uh, also, the drink right here. Go start another drink. I'll wait for him to pay. Good to go. Thank you very much. Get out of here. Come on, come on, come on. Keep keep the line moving. Keep the line moving. Let's do this. What can I get for you, bud? That's a spicy burger with fries. Totally have fries. Here we go. Oh no! Two stars. Hey, we had two stars. That's way better than zero stars. And we had none. An unhappy customer? What? An unhappy customer. Kyle wants me to smack the meat, but uh, but for that to happen, I think we have to end the stream. Um, yeah, no, I'm uh, I'm curious to see what that special move is all about. Uh, if it turns his meat golden, I don't know. That's interesting. I'm curious to check it out. But guys, that is that's my first impression of I'm Hungry. PSVR game, uh, I've never seen or heard of this before, like yesterday, uh, when they debuted the trailer. 
and uh, and that's and that's kind of it. So I'm excited to see Winking Park. Uh, see what that's all about. I'm excited to. Oh, whoa! What's what's going on here? Look at this. So this is showing all sorts of like. Oh, look! And you can even stretch them and like make them bigger. So these are all like different hints and stuff, like ways to. Yep. So you can make the drink golden by shaking it. Here, can we practice that right here? You can shake the fries to make them golden. You can smack the patty to make it... Here, let's, can we just do that right here? <laughs> it wobbles. Okay. Here, let's shake it. Yeah, I'm hungry too. I wonder if it's any leftover pizza. So... Oh... Wait, hold on. So this one says you got to turn it upside down and shake it. So maybe I wasn't totally paying attention to some of these. Um, not that. This looks pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> All you have to shake it for. No, it doesn't want to happen. Uh, maybe it only happens in game. Smack the fries, or maybe is it really sm smacking it? Nope, I don't know. I don't know. Make golden food. Breakthrough challenge. We'll figure this out one of these days. But guys, thank you very, very much for hanging out with me while I played the first few levels of I'm Hungry. Uh, and I hope you all have an awesome rest of your day. And, uh, and I hope you have an awesome rest of your night, depending on where you live. Um, oh, God, i got to get near my computer here so I can turn off the stream. All right, guys, thank you so much. I uh, appreciate each and every single one of what you're watching. Uh, as always, I love you all.